Hi, I'm Poppy Scoffings. I did Circle of Light last year and this year. When I got there, I said that I wanted to do singing, even though I wasn't completely sure. But I also brought my guitar with me as like a comfort blanket. Um, but then, because I let it that I did want to do singing, uh, they really pushed that and helped me like find my voice. And I wrote a few songs with um, a few groups of people um, and like, found that I could actually sing because it was so intense and it just stopped. I was like, oh no, that's it now, forever. Um, so when I found out that it was gonna be on again, I was like really happy and really wanted to be like properly involved with it. At the beginning of lockdown, I was feeling really down because like, it was meant to be my first year at uni and I'd had to come back in March. And then I've got a disabled brother, so I was caring for him a lot. I didn't, like, because of the care for him, I didn't really have enough time to make music or do anything that creative. Nobody understood my situation, really. The fact that I could come into Circle of Light for those intense three weeks again and thinking about how much I enjoyed it last time, um, I was, like, really, really excited. Sometimes, like, I can feel a bit stuck um, and, like, if there's nowhere to go that I can say, like, I have to go in or something to get out of the house, um, like, it's really hard because then I'll never go out and then I get stuck at home with my brother who doesn't really speak to me in the same way that I'd speak to, like, other people who haven't got his disability. Um, I think it having this space here is so good because I can come in and I can have a conversation and get some like respite from having to care for him all the time and speak to people who understand my situation because they know me now so um, if there's something that's happened or something I know that I can always talk to somebody here. Looking back now on first year I think it was really good because I got like the foundations of like confidence and being able to sing and writing my own music um, but then going into the, this year um, I've found my kind of my style and like genre my image as well um, and I think it this year allowed me to like bring out more of my my kooky side um, so that was really good. Me and Asa um, made a track together and it was like really good because we had like a lot of energy in the room and we did it in one day. It was like a new style. I'd never really done a sort of like spoken wordy sort of thing. Um, so I needed a bit of like guidance with that. And then um, I wrote another singy verse um, and he sent it to me so we could both listen to it that night. Um, and then we quickly finished it off the next day and I was so happy with it and like I loved the new sound and it kind of like felt more like my personality. I'd always wanted to like make a music video because I'm really interested in like the visual sides of it. I didn't know that it was possible to like make a music video in the circle of like three weeks so I didn't suggest it because I didn't want to push my luck or anything. But then Molly suggested it and I was like, oh my God, yes. I think the video was like really beneficial to um, me especially because I got to work with Molly and Fred and like got to learn so many different things like about filming and about um, dance. That was really good because obviously as a participant from the first year, um, I didn't see myself being able to like do that sort of thing um, and be on the same like level but that's because there's no like hierarchy here it's like everybody's ideas are as valid as everyone else's. It's given me a bit of like a boost because I'm really proud of how it looks and show that I can do that sort of thing and that I should do it more and work on it harder and um, that I'm doing the right thing so the fact that like we continue to be supported and stuff is like amazing I don't know a project like Circle of Light um, at school um, it feels as if they're like it's like ticking boxes to get you a GCSE or whatever it's not it doesn't really seem like they care about you as much as it they do in Circle of Light 
some people don't have the uh, facilities to make music at home or they can't because of various reasons and things stopping them and this site opens it all up and makes it so there's, you, there's always a space that you can come to with that same community that you know um, like a safe space as well as somewhere where you can always create music if you want to it's so good that we have like this kind of community um, and family so having this building is so important to lots of young people and everyone of different ages actually Circle of Lights made me feel happier as a person overall and more confident in myself in anything um, it's made me realise like I should say yes to a lot more things and open my mind to more opportunities um, and speak up more as well like people I've learnt that people value my opinion and that I shouldn't just like be quiet because that's what's expected of me I should speak up and like let my voice be heard a lot more